What's up, peeps? It's your girl, Raina Ray, for STL TV, where we allow you to experience St. Louis. And tonight, we are experiencing a local guy who made it all the way to national television and pitched his entrepreneurial idea to Shark Tank. We're going to talk to him, some of the other members of his team, some of his supporters. We got some celebrities in the house. We're going to find out what all the buzz is all about right here in City Hall tonight on STL TV, where you experience St. Louis. We always want to get behind somebody who's following their dream. This man is living proof that if you dream it, you can make it happen. And Cedric, this is a really special evening for you. Why is it so special tonight? Well, it's a super special evening, first of all, um, because we, we've been in business about four, four and a half years and worked extremely hard, a lot of bootstrapping, a lot of faith, a lot of hard work, a lot of obedience. And God has really elevated us to have the opportunity to be on, uh, be on America's number one reality show, which you know as Shark Tank. We're here in City Hall. We're bringing people in St. Louis together for something positive in a central building in this city that means so much to everybody but yet we're on a national level. What does that all mean to you? It is awesome. It is this is unbelievable. It is unbelievable. I do remember me and my husband having that conversation about being on Shark Tank and just from the beginning to now to just actually see it manifest. It's, it's unbelievable, it's awesome, it's great for our city, and I couldn't be more pleased. Why here tonight? Oh, that's such a great question. First of all, it, it just makes sense for it to be for it to happen at the mecca of everything. St. Louis is a city I absolutely love, and City Hall just makes sense. It's a place where we all rally together. We come here, we get our license plates, pay for tickets, all those different things. So this is really the intersection of St. Louis, and it makes sense to have it in this beautiful, beautiful space. We shopped around to quite a few venues, but this one really spoke to the heart of the issue, which is uniting St. Louis. St. Louis right now is on the cusp of something amazing, and being able to do this here in City Hall is monumental. This is, I think, the third or fourth largest event that's been held here at City Hall. The mayor's ball was won, and when uh, Obama was elected, they did the inauguration ball here. So this is actually the third or fourth largest event that they've had in this space, and we're honored to be able to do that here tonight with Cedric. We're here with Roland Williams. And Roland, I'm thinking to myself, you were sitting down one day thinking, I don't have enough flash. I need some pocket flash, too. And so, hence the pocket square. Well, I, I am excited to be back in St. Louis, and this time it's not football. It's something that's a little closer to my heart, literally oh, and figuratively. And uh, Cedric created the best pocket square holder. It's a, a game changer for men's fashion, and I'm just excited to be a part. All right, talk about this. Not only does it look amazing, it's spectacular. How easy, show us how easy it is to make best this happen. Show us how easy it is to make All this right, happen. Start easy. from scratch. I'm gonna give you a good one. So All right, give us a good one. Double-sided pocket round. Yes, really okay. okay. So how this works is you fold it in half four times going the same direction. So that's two, that's three, and that's four. Now, I've got this cone here. So I turn this cone around. Here's the pocket square holder. You squeeze it open, it's deep down to the bottom. Now check this out. I put this in here first. Now that it's in there, now put it in my jacket pocket. Check this out. So it goes in the jacket pocket, rests along the bottom. Now all I do is grab a loop on the outside, a loop on the inside, and I pull them apart. Look at that. It's like a rose blossoming. Like a, like a rose blossoming. We got all Beautiful. the videos to learn how to do it. We are the masters of this. The masters. Let me tell you, one of the biggest uh, issues a man has is to find the right pocket square. <laughs> yeah. Is it really that big I'm of a listen, deal? A Cedric said it's a big deal. It's, it's such a big deal. deal. It's like a woman trying to find the right purse. Oh, like, not. Or shoes? Right, or shoes, right. It's like, I don't, I cannot match the right pair. And so you find the perfect tie. As soon as you find the perfect tie, you're like, oh, that pocket square don't match. And then you put it in your pocket and you can't match it right. And then, oh my gosh. And then, so the first time I never forget when he sent me my first suits, right? He sent my first suits. I was like, wait a minute, I ain't got to mess with that? <laughs> you mean to tell me I don't have to rearrange that? And I'm telling you, like, for, for, for a man, for a gentleman, it's one of the biggest things that you like. Okay. <laughs> it's a funny thing because every time you get up in the morning, when I get up to go on set, I'll be like, oh, what? All sex already done. I text him, I say, boy, you so rough. Yeah, it's, 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 a really, it's a really important thing. I love fashion. I love to dress nice. It's just something that happens when you put on a great suit and all of your accessories are in place. 
And so I knew that this was the right thing for me because it's in my DNA. And so as you can see, Cedric is the same way. And so we share this passion and love for dressing nice and accessorizing the right way. I don't know the last time I've ever seen so many men so excited about fashion. <laughs> That's what's great, right? That's what's great. And, and a lot of people didn't know about fashion because no one ever taught you. No one ever sat down and said, here's how or why you wear a pocket square. Here's how you can accessorize and make it fun or make it more serious. And so I think it's just a great thing to do and um, I'm glad to be a part. Talk us through the dream. Oh dear God, the dream came out of frustration actually. The frustration was, was that I could not find anything that dignified to keep my pocket square in place. And I went on my journey after that and I said, ah, somebody's gotta fix this. I said, well, I guess it's gotta be me. So I went on that journey, took me a couple years to develop it, got it in the patent pending status, and went out there and bootstrapped it. Sell a few and flip them and sell a few and flip them and sell a few and just let it grow and germinate over time. And we did really well over the last four and a half years. I would like to welcome you all for the We're going to do some great things for this evening to make you to see you know, it's really easy for us to get our name on the negative list on the national press. And we've taken some L's over the years, but this right here is a positive one that we can put in the column that we can use to build off of. It's all about community, right? We are rallying here tonight to support one man who has created something for the city that is revolutionary and it's been given national attention. And that's what we need right now. My name is Shanika, I'm probably I'm 26 years. I won't read the entire over he has a resolution and a proclamation, which is awesome. To me, it means the world. You know, by being here, I first moved here in 98, you know, um, when I got drafted. And so to be a part of St. Louis's growth and progression, be a part of some of the pain points, um, to see all these triumphs, this is right along with one of the best things that have ever happened to St. Louis, especially from a business perspective, especially from a minority business perspective. And so this is a global show. Uh, Seven million people will be watching tonight's episode, and hopefully that will turn into a lot of success and more people realizing what St. Louis has to offer. Hello, Sharks. My name is Cedric Cobb. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri. <laughs> I'm seeking a $200,000 investment for 15% stake in my company. It's just great to have great partnerships, synergistic relationships that, that move the needle. And, and this is one of those businesses that move the needle. We actually help to change lives. How do we actually teach the young men how to return to what a gentleman is, right? And so I, I, I truly believe this, right? The way you look can almost dictate your destiny. See? And so that. I'm sorry, say that again. <laughs> no, I, I, I tell you, I learned it. I learned it as a young child. It ain't what you have, it ain't how much money you have. It's exactly how you look and how you carry yourself. We're addressing an issue of saying, why would you carry yourself a certain way? Why wouldn't you want to look a certain way? And, and I think for him going forward, I told him, I got your back, bro. Like, whatever we're going to do, let's do it, right? But let's go full speed and do it. And so I'm just excited to see him grow. I'm excited to see his vision come to fruition. And I'm excited just to be on this journey. It's going to be amazing. With any journey, you know, there's going to be ups and downs and all kinds of struggles and disappointments. It was a roller coaster ride, seriously. And so to be here at this point right now just shows you when you have some stick to itiveness and you're willing to follow the path that God has laid out for you, great things will happen. I remember watching the episode last week and when they did when they did the, the previews for this week. And I looked at that on TV and I said, Oh my God, it just got real. <laughs> it just got real. My husband is actually on TV. Pitching our business, the best pocket square holder for best wardrobe solutions, it is awesome. So when I was on the show, I was saying this to someone the other day, it was literally an out-of-body experience. I've never believed anybody when they say, I'm an out-of-body experience, what does that mean? Whatever, until I experienced it. So I literally felt like I had stepped outside my body and I was watching myself on television when it happened. When it was over with your heart's beating, your adrenaline's going, you really feel like you're about to pass out when it's all over with. Whether it goes good or whether it goes bad, you're like, oh my God, that actually really just happened. So yeah, it, it was an amazing, amazing experience. What do you say to somebody who's sitting there with an idea and they're thinking, uh, nobody wants to hear what I have to say. I, I'm never, it's never gonna happen. What do you have to say to those people right now? I'm gonna give you a real life situation. I know about three of them, but I'll give you one. 
There was a gentleman that got given an amazing gift in his sleep. Woke up out of his sleep, went downstairs, sketched it out two o'clock in the morning. Loved it. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Did nothing with it. Put it on the shelf for six years. Nothing happened with it. He decided to kind of come back around to it. He came back around to it. He said, well, let me look out here in the market and see if anybody created it. Someone had created it and it had already been selling on an, on an international level by then. So what happens actually is that you get given great ideas. Ideas are just ideas until they become a vision. When they become a vision, then provision comes in and you'll make, make sure that you help get the provision to happen to get there. But if you don't execute your dream, God will give it to someone else. You gotta get you one of the pocket square holders. Truly amazing. If you're like me, a man that loves pocket squares, loves ties, it's nothing like having your pocket square firmly in place during the whole party, during the whole gathering. Preachers need it. While you're preaching, you want to keep that thing intact, all right? Tell everybody where they can find you and find this product. Oh, absolutely. It's two great ways. Number one, you can go right to our website, which is bestwardrobesolutions.com. And, and also, you can go to our amazing free mobile app, which is also called Best Wardrobe Solutions. It's available Android and Apple devices, and you can do all your shopping in there. We got some great Shark Tank specials in there, and you know we got all the videos that help you out with it as well. Cedric Hobb, congratulations! You did it, man! You took it all the way to Shark Tank, and they ate it up. Those sharks jumped in and just grabbed every juicy bite they could. Anyways, I'm sure we're gonna see a whole lot more from Cedric. St. Louis guy making things happen. You keep it locked right here on STL TV where you get to experience St. Louis.